Stumpy, the Russian tank. It was a Czech tank apparently, rather than a Russian one, but it's Russian made even if it was with the Czech army. On the corner of Mandela Way and Pages Walk in South East 1. Pages Walk being the start point of run four of the Knowledge of London Pages Walk to the St Martin's Theatre. They like asking Stompy the Tank. Not really sure why, and I'm not really sure where it is officially because it's in that what well, is a private garden on the corner of Mandela Way and Pages Walk. I assume they'd probably want that left by Pages Walk. You can't get out of Pages Walk down onto Mandela Way and out to the Old Kent Road because you've got that barrier there in Mandela Way. They left the padlock unlocked, or maybe someone doesn't nick it around here. But that barrier does mean it's no through road from Pages Walk to Mandela Way. And I'm going to take a quick spin around of some of the points in the vicinity of Pages Walk. Heading north up Pages Walk. Guinness Square on the left is one they like asking. They'll use, usually ask that in conjunction with something going southeast if it's tricky to get to. You'd have to go right into Willow Walk, then go down Dunton Road, Mandela Way, and Humphrey Street to get back to the Old Kent Road because of that barrier down at the bottom of Pages Walk. The Victoria Pub, southeast one, they do ask that sometimes on the corner of Pages Walk and Willow Walk. Up to the junction of Grange Road. I'm going to turn right into Grange Road. As with everywhere this close to the middle of town, there are new apartment blocks springing up all over the place. Gutenberg Court on the left. I don't think they ask that. One thing they do ask very frequently is the Alaska Works, which was a fur factory just here by these gates. 61 Grange Road officially on the right. Also an entrance in Bacon Grove. Bacon Grove is a dead end street, so um, if you do leave the Alaska Works by Bacon Grove, you've got to go into Grange Road anyway. You can't get through down that end, it's barricaded off. I'm going to nip straight across from Bacon Grove into Spa Road. Bermondsey Spa Gardens on the right, they don't ask that as far as I'm aware, the little park. Tibetan Tea Room on the left, that's there because of this, the Tibetan Buddhist Meditation Centre. Kagyu Samyedzong, London. They like asking Tibetan things and Buddhist things at the carriage office. You should get a bit more Buddhist with taxi drivers rather than have them screaming out of the window every time um, somebody breaks in front of them or is looking for something and doing less than the speed limit. It's not as if the average taxi driver is a paragon of virtue himself when it comes to behaviour on the roads. Um, there is the Kagyu Samyedzong London Temple. Old Town Hall Apartments on the corner of Neckinger more or less.
TRA Hall, they do ask that sometimes on the left. 87 Spa Road officially, and they ask the Balanchi building, this nice new building on the left here. Some of the apartments you get into from this side. Spa Road, some of them you get in from the other side. In Enid Street, so left into Grill Road, just. And left into Enid Street with more entrances to the Balanchi building on the left. into Abbey Street. Neckinger Estate on the left. I'm tempted to go back down Neckinger because there's not a lot of note in Abbey Street. Abbey Street Junction with Tower Bridge Road. Abbey Street becomes Long Lane at the Bermondsey Street Junction, not at the Tower Bridge Road Junction. Quite a lot of band turns here. You can't turn right here as you see. You can't turn right if you're coming down Tower Bridge Road from my right onto Abbey Street. And you can't turn left onto Abbey Street if you're coming up from Tower Bridge Road, Southern Branch. Bermondsey Square on the left. There are things in here they ask. There's the Bermondsey Square Hotel, which they do ask in Bermondsey Street. And there's the Shortwave Theatre, which they also ask in Bermondsey Square. From Abbey Street, I'm going left down Bermondsey Street. Another entrance to Bermondsey Square walkthrough just on the left there. The Marigold pub, I don't think they ask that. Bermondsey Central Hall Methodist Church, they could ask that just on the corner there by Decimus Street, I don't think they do that. And they're in that converted toilet opposite us there in front of Barclays Bank is the Bermondsey Arts Club, which is a uh, you don't know it, it's a point you can very easily miss if you're looking for it. No band turns at all at this junction of Bermondsey Street, Grange Road and Tower Bridge Road, provided you do the left into Grange Road from the northern bit of Tower Bridge Road by going down that little filter road the other side of the toilets, which are now the Bermondsey Arts Club. Rocket Mansions on the left here, they don't ask entrances to that up Charbridge Road as well. I'm right into Charbridge Road. The Hartley Public House they used to ask quite a bit, that's gone on the corner of Webb Street. I still like say 64 the Hartley. And one thing they ask quite a bit, the Haddon Hall Baptist Church, just there on the left corner of Leroy Street. I'm going around the Bricklayer's Arms and into Old Kent Road to have a look at the Tarbridge Care Home, which is on the left, just here, entrance to this in Abadour Street. Old Kent Road left into Abadour Street. And there is the Tower Bridge Care Home. Wasn't quite sure if the entrance to that is still round here, but it is. 
out of here and back onto Tower Bridge Road. There never used to be any bad turns at the junction as you come out of Avadoa Street and it doesn't look as though there are. Turn left or right onto Tower Bridge Road from here. I'm going straight across to have a look at what was the Hartley's Jam Factory. Now the Jam Factory Apartments into Green Walk and there in front of us are the Jam Factory Apartments which is still occasionally asked as the Hartley's Jam Factory you can just about see the Hartley's logo there still at the top below the roof of that particular wing and I'm going to go back out of Green Walk because they have just closed Rothsay Street which is the one north of here and they've made that cycles only from Alice Street back out on the Tower Bridge Road. So I'm going back up Tower Bridge Road to have a quick look in Bermondsey Street. filter road here down on the left hand side to get round into Bermondsey Street and Decimus Street they've pedestrianised that and put up a statue of some sort but I confess I've no idea what that statue is other than it obviously looks like a First World War soldier of some description back around into Bermondsey Street from where I've just come past the Marigold Pub and Clooney Place again and across the Abbey Street Long Lane Junction into the main arm of Bermondsey Street St Mary Magdalene Church on the right Newham's Row quite a few blocks in there Royal Oak Yard, also a few new blocks they've converted from warehouses down there. Bell Yard News on the right. Bickles Yard on the right is something they might ask. White Cube on the left corner of Landwalk. Landwalk, they do ask that. I forgot that was there actually. I think of that as being in Hoxton, the White Cube Gallery. Cross Tanner Street. Garrison Public House on the corner of White's Grounds and we'll call this off outside the Fashion and Textile Museum on the right in Bermondsey Street just opposite Tyres Gate a run around of the points in the vicinity of Pages Walk at the start of Run 4 of the Knowledge of London. <laughs> 